my dear students welcome to commissioner rate of collegiate education i am jl prasad lecturer in zoology government degree college kalyandur today we are going to learn about the preparation of project report for banking and insurance this comes under poultry farming which is an integral part of skill development course the learning objectives of today's session are we are going to learn about the preparation of project proposal for loan to start a poultry farm later how that project report will be appraised will be known that means the modus operandi of a project appraisal will be discussed followed by loan disbursement mechanism and at the end we are going to discuss we are going to learn about the insurance coverage we know that poultry has greater potential for generating employment and resolving food crisis in india and this poultry may be started as a cottage industry that means any farmer can start the poultry at his backyard but backyard poultry caters only to the family calorific needs community calorific needs are greater in its magnitude so cottage poultry industry or backyard poultry industry is not sufficient to cater to the needs of calorific requirements of a community but many indian families even today start their own poultry at the backyard with minimum number of birds in such cases village cooperatives and self help groups provide the financial assistances but whereas community calorific requirements are greater in their magnitude as a result only commercial poultry industry can alone cater to the needs of a community commercial poultry business demands much financial assistance at the larger scale banks provide the financial assistance in such cases to the commercial poultry farm insurance companies will also offer minimum security to the poultry business because we know pretty well that the poultry farming is uh, totally conditioned by the vagaries of nature that means it is affected by the extremes of nature as a result insurance companies will come to the rescue in such occurrence of disasters and the break up of pandemics financial support will be extended to the poultry by district rural development agencies that is drdas banks krishi vigyana kendras and also by non governmental organizations and there are many schemes that provide financial assistance to the poultry integrated rural development program pradhan mantri gramin sadak yojana development of women and children in rural area that means uh, that's called dwakra of course and state and central governments will sponsor these schemes financial assistance by banks is also provided for the poultry towards the construction of sheds feed purchase of instruments like dv cup feed containers nest boxes and egg trays in such cases land cost may be treated as margin money for sanctioning the loan no doubt banks will provide assistance financial assistance banks will consider the advantages and the profit generation scope while sanctioning such a loan that means when the project report is prepared by the poultry farmer and if the same is submitted to the bank bank will undoubtedly estimate the advantages and profit generation scope of that proposal so it will look whether it is a broiler farm or layer farm we know that broiler is a fowl that is meant for meat production whereas layers are meant for egg production broiler farming needs less investment investment to start a broiler farm is less and broilers have efficient feed conversion ratio gestation period for broilers uh, farming is less and returns can be expected from a broiler farm within 8 weeks 
that means while preparing a project report all these parameters all these constraints should be presented to the bank in the form of a proposal so no doubt banks will provide the assistance but when the farmer is going for a loan he has to prepare a project report stating the advantages and disadvantages and broiler farming has got much advantages when compared to the layer farming and public demand and market value for broiler is more and it is more extensive when compared to the layer rate of growth of broiler and layer farms is 10% and 7% respectively financial assistance is provided for starting a poultry farm by the banks after the due submission of the project report of course and let us see how the project report has to be prepared what are the key indicators metrics that should be included while preparing a project proposal project proposal should contain the following details construction of sheds fencing details equipment and its cost machinery and its cost cost of labor what is the honorarium or remuneration salary you are paying for that water electricity feed vaccination and the cold storage equipment installation charges and it should also include the transport charges of the chick chicken eggs etc to the market and project report should include technical information management information and also financial information technical information includes location of the farm site map distance size capacity number of sheds go down staff members feed particulars water power availability and consumption veterinary equipment flock projection chart financial information includes margin contribution capital investment building cost machinery and land management information includes details of the borrower that means whether he is a defaulter or not whether he has got some sort of security whether he has got very sound property or not it will be estimated credit rating of the borrower is uh, already displayed in the website of the bank itself track record of the borrower in the same field is also essential because uh, if the farmer has already achieved some sort of profit accomplished some sort of uh, profit in this field that can be a positive point while preparing the project report skill development training facilities should also be mentioned here along with the environmental and other clearances if there are any and has to mention whether it is an individual venture or partnership venture and once this project report has been submitted which contains technical information financial information and management information this project will be appraised that is called project appraisal that can be done by an individual branch to which the proposal is submitted feasibility of the sanctioning the loan will be studied by the local branch after the submission of the report and the loan will be dispersed in two stages at the first stage the first installment will be given towards the development of infrastructure facilities like construction of shed and purchase of machinery and the second installment will be given to meet the expenditure towards purchase of chicks of feed and medicines margin money should be met by the investor and it may range from 12 to 27% of course interest will be fixed by the banks as per rbi guidelines it may be a floating interest or fixed interest the rate of interest may vary from 11 to 12% maximum 8 years period will be given for repayment of loans refinance facility is also provided by nabot and uh, sometimes the poultry farmer may be illiterate he may not be in a position to prepare or design a project report for loan proposal in such cases nabod consultancy services will assist 
the former in the preparation of detailed project report. And the last segment of this session is insurance. As I repeatedly told, the poultry farming is uh, affected by the vagaries of nature, extremes of nature, disasters, uh, breakup of pandemics like that. In such cases, minimum insurance coverage is provided by the following companies like the National Insurance Company, New India Insurance Company, Oriental Insurance Company, United India Insurance Company, like that. And insurance coverage is uh, extended against deaths from certain diseases and other accidents, civil disorder, cyclone, earthquakes, fire, flood, lightning, riots, strikes, terrorism, and diseases. Minimum number of birds required for insurance is 500. Under general type, 100 broilers per batch, 500 layers per batch, 2000 uh, fowl per hatch in hatcheries will be considered, will be covered. And the age group is very essential for fixing up premium rates. For a broiler, day one to eight weeks, uh, it requires the rating of 1.5% of peak value. And for a layer, day one to 27 weeks, 3.2% uh, slab is fixed. Value of the bird is fixed in relation to its age. And after a loss, the claim should include the veterinary certification, mortality record, and certificate from a qualified veterinary doctor, that means veterinarian, and purchase invoice and medical bill. So these are the various aspects and criteria that should be considered while applying for a loan and also while claiming the loss in a poultry farm. At the end, my profuse thanks to CCE AP Vijayawada.